Hi everyone, thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Erily, welcome to my channel. Before we begin, I would like to apologize for the way the um, everything is set up. I, ha I am using a new device and I'm still trying to get a hang of it. All right then, okay, so um, now let's get started. Um, if you guys would like, you can go ahead and click the like button and the subscribe button, followed by the bell button to get notified on my next videos. For this video, I am doing a pick a card, what is coming to you in December 2019. This is going to be a short video, a short reading, just a general. So if it resonates with you, go ahead and let me know. And if it doesn't resonate with you, you might, you might want to try picking another set. Um, so um, I will provide the timestamp down below in the description box the way you can see which card deck i mean card set to pick is simply by closing your eyes relax taking three deep breaths and as soon as you're ready to open up your eyes the deck or decks that instantly pulls you in will be the decks of your choice all right so this is cards one cards two cards three and cards four All right, so now let's begin. All righty, so let's see what we have here. We have, okay, we have Inanna. I believe that's how you say it. We have Ace of Swords. King of Cups. We have Death. We have Ray. All right, so I do apologize. That's all I can get for right now. Um, here, I'll just put it all down anyway. So we have Salmon and we have Reversed Moon. Okay, so, all right, let me see. Oh, I guess I can fit all, fit all of it. Okay. All right. So let me see. Okay. So what I am seeing here is that <clears throat> you are going to feel much, much more sexier. You are going to feel much more seductive, um, charming, handsome, like you can get things the way how you want it. Um, things will start going your way. You will be, um, you know, um, what's it called? Somewhat bribing. And um, you're, you're just going to feel fabulous for this month of December. And what I am also getting is that there has been a loss that you recently went through and you still are going through. And... Um, and that's going to get better this month. Like it's been bothering you a lot. It might, it could be any type of loss. Maybe you've lost some money, a job, a relationship, somebody in your family passed away. It could be anything. I do sense a loss and you're going to overcome that. You're going to be stronger this month be, um, because of that, because that loss happened to you, you, you know, it really, it hurt at you, but you're going to get right back up in December. And, um, and I don't see you getting back up 
that that strong in the month of December, but it's the beginning of you getting yourself back up or, you know, you getting yourself, you know, maybe somebody hurt at you and you're going to for, start forgiving them this month. You're going to be more forgiving and more of like, okay, I'm just going to deal with it. And um, let me see. I do see, um, I was going to say determination, but I see that right here. You are going to be more capable of, of making new friends and relationships because you're going to be more talkative. For this month of December, you're going to want to be more around other people. Um, you're just going to feel very powerful, very friendly, very ambitious. Um, let me see. And, you know, with this Ray card, it says yoga and exercise are essential to your well-being, peace of mind and spiritual growth right now. What I'm seeing from that card is that you're going to be, you know, of course, it says it right there, yoga and exercise. I feel like you lack of exercise and you lack on energy. And for this month of December, you know what? Since you're going to feel sexy and handsome, you're going to be a, you know, a go-getter this month. You're going to be like very outgoing and um you're you know, you're just going to feel very beautiful this month and um let me see. And and, you know, you're, you know, since you're going to have all of this energy in December, it's going to be like, like, you know, you're exercising, you know, you're, you're exercising your, your, um, you know, like up and moving a lot. I'm sorry. I don't know. I'm, I'm doing this really late at night because I know I'm not going to have time to do it tomorrow. <laughs> okay. Mm, let me see. Psalm and determination. You know where you are going you will get there. So what I'm seeing with this Salmon card is, okay, like I said, you know, like something has been bothering you for a really long time and this month is going to be the first step that you take to get better, to become stronger, to overcome that. Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay. So, you know where you're going and you will get there. Okay, so there, you know, not not just that loss that you have recently went through, but there is something else that's been bothering you for years, something that, you know, happened since you were a childhood. And I feel like since you're going to be more stronger, more powerful this month of December, that childhood trauma is going to come back but it's going to not weaken you anymore. It's going to make you stronger. You're going to overcome that also. Not just this recent loss that you've went through, but some childhood trauma that you went through. Um, you could have been abused since you were a little kid. and Or you could have been um, bullied when you were a little kid. And, um, you know, it, it it's affected you this whole time growing up, it's made you not be able to trust anybody. It's made you not be able to trust any relationships that you get into friendships or, you know, love relation relationships. You, you, I feel like you can't even trust your own family members, like your siblings, you know, and, or your mom and dad, because they're, you know, something horrible happened to you back then to where you feel like you can't trust anybody. And if you have any children, I feel like, you know, because the moon card came out, if you have any children, the reverse moon card came out, if you have any children, that childhood trauma, it's going to affect, has affected you or is going to affect you if you don't have any kids yet, but it's, it's affected you in a way to where like, it's going to affect your children, you know, like, you know, say you don't trust anybody, you're going to raise your kids not to trust anybody. But you know what? That's not a bad thing at all to not trust anybody. That's not a bad thing at all. It's a good thing. You're you're protecting yourself. And if you're protecting yourself, no matter what you do, if you're protecting yourself, then protect yourself. Don't let anybody else tell you anything bad about that. Okay, let me see. And also with the reverse moon card... 
I'm getting that this change is suddenly going to out of nowhere hit you. Like, yes, you've been procrastinating on this change for a very long time. But one day, maybe one morning when you wake up or one night when you're falling, when you're about to fall asleep, something is just going to hit you in your brain to let you know, hey, you know what? Stop procrastinating. Time to, you know, overcome this or time to change, time to get your act right. Or like if you've been procrastinating on, um, on, you know, your errands or like, you know, you're, you're way behind on your bills or you're way behind on your errands. You haven't caught up to anything. It's just going to hit you one day. And maybe you're like a person that's always late to everything. It's just going to hit you one day in December that, you know, you're going to change your mind and say, Hey, I don't want to be like this anymore. It's too much stress, you know, being behind on everything. It's a lot of stress. So whatever it is that you decide to do in December, I wish you luck and thank you guys so much for watching. Now moving on to cards number two. If you guys liked this video, go ahead and click the like button and please let me know what you think of the video in the comments and if this resonated or not. All right. Thank you guys so much. Bye. All right. So moving on to cards number two. Okay, we have Determination. Well, another Determination card. Ace of Wands. Uh, Six of Cups. The Hermit. Teresa. monkey and reverse page of earth okay let me see let's see right here okay so what i am seeing is that you're going to be a lot of you that chose number two i sent a lot of feminine energies most of you guys are very feminine or female, or male that are feminine, um, I sense that. And there's going to be a male coming into your life. I definitely see a male. I don't see, maybe a woman that's, that's masculine. But, you know, somewhere around that masculine energy, I sense a masculine energy coming to you in December. And it's going to, they're going to be your new relationship. I mostly see a love relationship, but it could be somebody that you become closer to, like somebody that reminds you of a brother, you know, somebody that um that looks up to you. And I feel like these past few months has been very hard on you, very tough on you. You're tired, you're stressed out, you're overeating, you've been overthinking a lot, but this month you are determined to stay healthy and you know it says right here time out you've been so busy taking care of everyone else needs but now it's time to stop and take care of yourself so you are going to be determined to take more care of yourself you're going to be more focused on yourself on your new lifestyle you're going to have a completely different way of thinking like you've been there for you know you've been there so much for others that you never even had time for yourself. But I do see that this relationship is really going to help you out a lot. This male coming into your life, it's he's going to make you so much more happier. And um, you know what? Just because you're going to, I mean, you're going to be in this relationship with him. And you guys are going to be seeing each other a lot. Like I do see a romantic relationship. But like I said, it could be somebody that reminds you of a brother um, and, um, you know, you're going to be so busy with him 
that you're still going to forget about taking care of yourself. You're also going to be busy taking care of someone else. Somebody, a younger person is going to be looking up at you. And that's what the hermit card tells me. Somebody younger than you is going to be looking up to you, venting to you a lot and, and you know, trying to cope with their feelings, but they can't. So they go to you because they see you as an older um um, like brother or sister, or they see you as a mom or dad, um, they really look up to you. And, you know, I'm just letting you guys know, be ready for this. If, you know, it's happened already, because I know it's already December, you know, good job, good job on being there for that person. I know it's very draining. And that's why Teresa says, take care of yourself. You've been too busy. With the monkey card, it says ingenuity. The situation calls for adaptability and innovation. So, okay, all right. So, I know that once you start to take more care of yourself, it's going to be hard for you not to not care about other people around you. So you're you're just going to have to learn how to balance that out. Take care of yourself and take care of others. If taking care of others is the thing that you love to do genuinely, go ahead, continue on helping them, but please balance it out. Put a limit to that. You know, just put a limit like maybe a couple hours, one hour a day you can talk to somebody about, you know, with um about their problems or maybe you know, um, take about one day out of your week to be there. But you right this month, you will need to focus more on yourself, focus more on your health, your sleep, your um eating, you know, you um your you know your saneness, you know um um. So yeah, but you know, good job on taking care of other people. But please don't forget about taking care of yourself. Okay, with the page of earth reverse, let's see. Um, mm -hmm, okay, so I feel like you've been, um, I feel like you've been um, wanting to try something new, like trying a new job. Um, and I feel like, you know, you've been doing what you do. Maybe you've been at this job that you have right now for a very long time and you've been tired of it. Um, you've been tired of it. You've been wanting to get a new job. And I think I'm feeling that this month of December is when you're going to find a new hobby, find out what it is that you would cherish doing, find out what's what's new that's going to make you happy <clears throat> and um you know it doesn't have to be a job it could be anything like i said like a hobby it could be um something new is going to come to you this month that you haven't tried before and you're gonna do it okay all right so that's all i'm picking up for cards number two now moving on to cards number three. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys liked the video, go ahead and click the like button. Make sure to click the bell and the subscribe button to keep notified on my next videos. Thank you all so much for watching. Bye now. Okay, so cards number three. We have Arachne Hubris. Four of Swords, Eight of Cups, Page of Pentacles, Indrio, Dove, and Reversed, Four of Earth. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, so what I'm seeing here is that you've been extremely exhausted. Um, but this month of December, wow. Okay, a lot of eyes are going to be lay, um, laying, a lot of people are going to be laying their eyes on you. A lot of people are going to be watching you for group number three. This is going to be really creepy. You're, you know, 
I don't know what it is. Maybe you're more glowy this month. You're more happier. But every room that you walk into, you're going to notice that a lot of people are turning their heads looking at you. You may going, be going to a party and then you catch all of these attention. You may walk into the doctor's office and, you know, all of the clients are all looking at you. Um, you're going to notice that a lot more people are going to be talking to you. And um, yes, this can be very overwhelming, right? And the reason why a lot of people are going to be looking at you more is, you know, like I said, because you are going to be more glowy. You're going to be more happier this month. And um, and there's some, there's some positive thoughts that you've been putting out there. And it's finally going to manifest. It's finally going to come back to you. And you know what? When you, since you've been working on those positive thoughts and positive prayers, positive um, motivation, um, it it is coming back to you in December. And that's why a lot of people are going to be turning necks, looking at you. You know, the Page of Pentacles shows all of this success all of this positive success <clears throat> before all of that you've been very tired you've been um let me see you've been very tired you've been walking away from a lot of problems from a lot of people and uh let me you are a light worker god needs you to shine your divine light and love like an angel upon the earth you are a light worker god needs you to shine your divine light and love like an angel above upon the earth and all of its inhabitants okay so i can see why now you've been walking away from a lot of people and you're very very exhausted is because you have this ability you're a very sensitive person you have this ability to <clears throat> sense other people's energies whether it's positive or negative and you know, like I, you know, like I said, <clears throat> you've been putting out all of these positive words out there to the universe and now it's coming back to you and that's why you're starting to succeed in December. You have this ability <clears throat> to manifest what you want. Um, let me see, Dove, Serenity, slow down, pause and breathe. Okay. Okay, so when I read this card, it's letting me know, like, you've been feeling like you want to just spread your wings and fly. You want to feel free. You want to feel like you're, you are a free spirit. You are. You have nobody taking control of you. You have nobody taking control of your life. You are taking control of your life. You're under control. But there has been something that's been holding you down, locking you down. Um, maybe you're in um, a relationship where the your partner doesn't let you do anything. Or maybe you have kids and you feel like, oh, I never have the time to go out and do anything alone. Oh, I never have time to relax. And... This month, it's just going to be over, very overwhelming for you that you are just going to want to run and breathe and take time to yourself. And you haven't had that time for your, to yourself in a long time. But this time, this month, you will be able to. And the spirits are letting you know to slow down, pause and breathe, like relax, okay? Whatever it is that is holding you down and making you tired, you know, maybe you've been having tears scrolling down your cheeks, um, but you know what, don't worry, okay, you are strong, you're a light worker, you, um, you can, you can, you have the ability to get what you want, you just gotta manifest it, you just gotta, you just gotta do it, you know, like, like how you're using those positive words it's coming back to you. So all of these good things are going to be coming back to you. With this card, Four of Earth Reversed. Um, let me see. Oh, 
Okay, so some blessing is going to be coming your way. And this is due to because, oh, I don't know why I keep, I don't even, sorry, I didn't even notice that I keep saying, you know, because you put out positive words in there. I was going to say that I didn't, I, I didn't even notice that I've been saying that until right now. <laughs> okay. So all of these, um, yeah, you know, it's like a confirmation right there. Again, confirmation that all of these positive words you've been putting out there for yourself is coming back to you in December. You've probably already seen it. Now, remember, this is a general reading, so I can't exactly say what blessing is coming your way. But yes, expect a blessing. Expect something wonderful. Expect a miracle to happen this month in December. Something that hasn't happened to you before is going to happen. Or maybe it's it hasn't happened in a long time for years and you deserve this. This month is a time where you will get granted the wish that you've been longing for. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. Now moving on to cards number four. If you guys liked this video, go ahead and click the like button and subscribe and the bell button to get notified on my next live videos. Um, please let me know what you guys think of this, if it resonated, um, if you have any questions, if you have any, um, you know, any new ideas for what I can do, um, what videos I can make, go ahead and let me know. I love to hear everybody's opinions and thoughts. Thank you guys so much. Bye. Now, moving on to cards number four, we have Inara. We have Seven of Swords. We have King of Wands. Um, Seven of Cups. Daniel, the Angel. A possum and five of water all right oh my goodness okay okay you are going to be a little sneaky this month Ooh. okay I see somebody being very sneaky very mischievous disobedient no I'm just playing um not in all those bad ways but yeah if I wanted to put it in a bad way I would say mischievous disobedient um, a sinner, <laughs> no, I'm just playing, but yeah, you're going to have a lot of fun and games this month. You, you are through with everybody. You are tired of everything that's going around you. That's been happening to you. You are just done with everything and everyone. So you are going to be this tricky person. You are going to like basically disguise yourself you're going to be the complete opposite of who you are i mean you should have done it for halloween you know but you know anyways i'm just playing um yeah so um these two cards lets me know that you're going to be doing something sneaky behind someone's back but i don't see it in a bad way you know with these king of wands and the seven of cups I don't see you doing it because you want to sin. I don't see you doing it because, you know, you want to purposely be bad. You want to do it because it's going to be fun to you. You know, you're all about games this month. You're all about bringing your child, childness out. You're all about, you know, like exploring more about yourself. You know, you're trying to figure out more about yourself. What is it that you like? You know, are you a serious person? Are you a mad person? Or are you... A childlike person or are you just like you know you're 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 too old to even do anything you know what type of person are you and that's what you're trying to figure out um i see a lot of um if you are a um let me see okay i don't know for some reason you know, your social media, you're going to be getting more friends requests on your page or like, you know, I don't know much about social media, but whatever it is that, you know, when people look at you, you're going to get a lot more views on your social media. If you are like a um, social media person, um, 
if not, I do sense, um, if you're not a social media person, right? I don't know, like some, you're going to catch someone's attention, right? Okay. I don't know. I just, I feel that energy. Like you're, you're going to catch someone's attention. That's going to just try to figure you out, you know, like you're mysterious to them and they like all they want to do is get to know you and try to figure you out if you were you've already came across this person please let me know um i would like to talk about it just to see how this person is with you um let me see so what daniel says i am the angel of marriage and i am assisting you right now whoa so that means somebody is going to propose to you no i'm just playing somebody um Somebody's not going to propose to you. I mean, like, yes, it might happen. You never know. I don't know how many people's watching this video, but for those who is choosing, who chose cards number four, um, a blessing is going to be coming your way, right? Okay. And all right. So now, okay, I figured it out now. So the person that is going to be wanting to find out who you are right this is talking about a romantic relationship they they like you like they secretly admire you and um let me see what else am i picking up mm. okay all right so Okay, besides this card, from this whole picture I'm seeing is you're going to be working more with your mind. You're like, you know, like how I said, you're going to be playing a lot of games. You're going to be like a mind reader also. And I don't know, like something working more with your mind. You're going to like maybe read a lot more books. You're going to educate yourself more often. You're going to um, do more research, you know, just trying to educate yourself on everything. You're going to um, you're going to be more open to different resources. Um, something with like gaining more knowledge, like you want to gain more knowledge this month, like you want to educate your brain, you want to know more, you want to learn and grow more and you know, like I said, how you are trying to find out who you are. And by that, it's going to make you want to read a lot more. And for some reason, I'm picturing you guys watching, you know, sitting down, watching TV. And everything that you watch, every movie that you watch or every commercial that you come across, you're educating yourself like, I don't know, like, I don't know, I, for some reason, I'm just picturing you guys, like, every, you know, when every movie that you watch, somebody's going to say something, and you're just going to try to figure out what the next person's going to do, or what 